in California, we've lost about 90% of our tidal marshes. Here in Elkhorn Slough, we've lost about 50%. And that's a problem because if we don't have that habitat, then we lose those animals that rely on that habitat. This is a tidal wetland restoration project. And this is the first opportunity that we've had to do some real restoration, large-scale restoration of tidal marsh in Elkhorn Slough. We're restoring almost 10% of the habitat in this area, the special critical habitat. The marsh that's lost here is lost because it's dropped or it's subsided. So the only way really to restore it is to bring the dirt in and bring soil in and fill it back up so those marsh plants can come back in and grow here. It takes a long time to do a project like this. They'll, they're moving about 200,000 cubic yards of soil and they can move between one and 2,000 cubic yards a day. So they'll be at this for about eight months. This project is 61 acres of tidal marsh restoration and then the, once they remove the soil, the grassland behind will be restored to a native dominated grassland. In five years, we should have healthy marsh. We should have a nice mixture of ecotone plants. A project like this is really special because it shows that we can restore this habitat to a healthy system. The lessons that we learn from this project will not only help us in restoring the rest of Elkhorn Slough, but will also help up and down the state to restore this rare habitat.